Okay, to uh, go ahead and add a book to any list on Goodreads, you're going to click on Browse, go to Lists, and this will take you to the Listopia page. Now, uh, you might like some of these lists mentioned here. Uh, you might scroll down and choose a list from the lists with recent activity. Or um, there's a section here for lists my friends have voted on. Um, or you can go up here to this search lists and you can type in, for example, Christian historical romance, and then you click search. Now, let's see. That brings up historical fiction from 2014, best Christian historical fiction, most anticipated Christian fiction 2018. You get the idea. So let's say you wanted to find something from this year. Well, let's go ahead and add the year and search again. Here we go. Most anticipated Christian fiction of 2024. Let's say we wanted to add our book to this. I'm going to click on that link and wait for it to load. Here we go. Now I'm just going to scroll down a little bit. All right. Now, here you can see there are buttons that say vote for this book, vote for this book. So say you see a, a book on this list that you think was really amazing. Sarah Sundin's at the top. That doesn't surprise me at all. She's a fantastic author. We also have Rosanna M. White, Karen Winmeyer, Lena Eason. No surprises there, right? Okay, so if you wanted to vote for one of those books, you could go ahead and click on those. Um, unfortunately, I have not had the time to read any of these yet, so I'm not going to click on any of those. But we're here to add a new book, right? So how do we do that? First, click on Add Books to this list. Now, um, here it is showing me a list of books that I have recently added to my own list. That's the My Book section. If it didn't automatically pack up, pop up, you can go ahead and click on my books and it would show it to you. I'm going to go ahead and click search. I'm going to go ahead and type in that and I'm going to type in my latest book release, Shoot at the Sunset, click search. And there it is. Now, if I wanted to add it to this list, I would go ahead and click vote for this book. Now, since it's my book and that feels a little bit self promoting I'm not going to do that. So let's think of another one I've read lately that I do think belongs on this book. How about, um, to speak his name. I think that one definitely belongs on this list. So I'm going to go ahead and um, rate that. Oops, as you can see, I haven't written my review yet. I will um, add that in later. But for right now, I'm just going to save that. And scroll back up. Now, all I did right there is I just added my rating. And now I'm going to vote for this book added to your list. So there you go. Now it's on the list. Uh, let's see if we can go back and find it. And click on here. Hmm. I haven't gone backward yet to actually verify it. Let me see. Most anticipated Christian fiction. I'm just going to highlight that. Copy. Go back to the main Listopia page. Type that in here. Okay, uh, here is that list. And we're going to scroll down. I believe because I just added it, it will most likely be at the bottom. Oops. Let me scroll up again. Okay, let's see. Top 100. So yeah, you have to scroll. You have to go to the next page to find the one. There it is. Number 129. So it's on the list. And you know what? Even though it looks like I added it, it says that nine people have voted. So which means that eight people added it before I did. But there you go. That's how you can uh, add a book to the list.